Hey Cancers, I'm back y'all with another video. So let's jump right into it, all right? So let's see what messages we got. These are general love messages, so they may or may not resonate with you. If it happens to resonate, all the better. Be sure to hit the like button as well as subscribe if you are new. All right, so let's see what messages we get for the Cancers. What's going on with Cancers in love? What's going on with Cancers in love, please? Any message for the Cancer? Show me how Cancer's person is feeling about Cancer, please. So you got somebody that's super attracted to you. They could be physically attractive to you. Like they could really like your personality. There's something about you that they are extremely attracted to. But at the same time, I feel like you're, the person that you were dealing with, they may have lost themselves for a little while. Um, maybe they aren't acting like themselves, like how they would normally act. Um, this could be because there was some type of lesson, some type of spiritual lesson that was learned um, in regards of you two dealing with each other. So I see them over here wishing that they had treated you better because I got them thinking of you, um, thinking of things that remind them of you. And then we got, you don't know how hard it was to let you go. So somebody is like having a hard time letting you go. Somebody's having a hard time letting you go. But they lost themselves. They they lost themselves. They done lost themselves in the sauce. Um, they're wishing that they treated you better. But it's hard for them to let you go. This person could be hiding behind material things. Um, wishing that they could take back their words. But they they are kind of like looking for you everywhere. Like they're trying to find their way back to you. Okay. This could be you feeling this way. Or this could be. This could go either way. Vice versa. Take it how it is. But I'm definitely seeing like somebody having a hard time letting go. Okay. It's not easy to let go. I want to know what happened. So let's see what's what. This person could be hiding behind material things, like trying to mask their pain. They could be going out shopping overspending, just doing things to try to kind of like make themselves feel better. Yeah, they've been spying on you. <laughs> they've been spying on you. They're watching you. They could be riding by your house because you're not answering their phone calls. Why are they spying Why are they spying on cancer? Yeah, we got camera and date. Okay, so they want to see if you're dating. If you're dating someone new. So they could be spying on you because they want to see if you're dating someone new. I told you this person is wearing a mask. So now this person over here regretting something that they said to you. Yeah, it could have. Okay, so the last time that you guys were together and romantically together, which I mean like intimate, because we got passion here. It looks like somebody, somebody let something slip out. It was real risky. Okay, maybe they slipped up and said that they had some other options um, or they were taking some type of risk or taking some type of leap of faith and they ran off. 
They ran off. They want to take back some words. Why is passion here? Why is passion here? Now they're sitting up here reminiscing about you, looking at pictures, missing you. This person missing you. Somebody is missing you. Gosh, somebody miss it, is missing you. They look for you everywhere. This thing says, I look for you everywhere. Girl with the snake and a chaser. So this person wanted you to chase them. They say it's your turn to chase me this time. We got clock, love, and chaser. So they're saying, look, it's your time to chase me now. You need to chase me. Because um, it looks like here, girl with the snake is an empath. Somebody who can have empath abilities, narcissistic paradigm, like a narcissist that would love dealing with somebody who is easily used or is an enabler or doesn't have many boundaries um, set so they can come in and just manipulate manipulate their minds, okay? But they say, look, this time you're going to chase after me. They want, They wanted you to chase them. They wanted you to chase them. Wow. <laughs> Who are y'all dealing with? Okay, let's see what else they want to say. Okay. So it looks like they're ignore they could have been ignoring you or ignoring other people. But they could have been ignoring you because they needed to make a decision. Okay, they needed to make some type of decision. They said stop pushing me. I need to make my own choices. What else? What else does this person want to say to cancer? I'm undecided about us. I need time to think this through. Don't rush me. I'm sorry for what I said. Yeah. This person could feel like you're too good for them. Like they don't deserve you. One minute they want to make this work. One minute they don't. It's like they here one minute and next minute they're not. Um, this person is dreaming about you as well. And if this person is being quiet from you right now, it's because they're trying to protect you from their ego. They could be really focused. They're trying to focus on work. But they are coming in with an offer soon. I want to date you. <laughs> I have a lot of sexual thoughts about you. We are on hold, but I'm coming back for you. I, I felt that. I felt that <laughs> like they were gonna try to slide back in because I'm getting like somebody is missing you. Um, they they regret something that they said to you. They must be said something real mean and nasty because there's something that they said that they wish that they could take back. person coming towards cancer i feel like this person could come back during mercury retrograde um i feel this person trying to manifest their way back into your energy back into your <laughs> back into your world Yep, Knight of Cups. Here's this person with an offer. I see them coming with some type of truth or clarity.
They want to make some type of plans. Okay, they want to try to make some type of plans with you. So they're coming with some type of offer. They're coming. They're coming in with the offer. This person could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or a earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. We got Leo energy here, too. This person may not be confident enough to come to you right now um, because of how it ended. Could be a cancer, like yourself. They are they are changing things. They could be changing their image, changing on switching up things. Um, I see them making some type of changes. Yeah, see, we got the King of Wands, Two of Wands, and the Emperor, and the Eight of Pentacles, and the Ten of Wands. So this person knows that they got a lot of things that they need to work on within themselves, okay? Because they know that you don't even like you. This is your energy. Like, you don't even, it's like a no. Because you're looking at this person like this. Like, they're the Knight of Wands. Like, they're in and out. They're too uh, unreliable, this person going, they're going to tell you that they're going to put in more effort because they want to see what you're going to say. All right. They want to see what you're going to say. They're going to, they, they just testing the waters, but they are coming in. I feel like they're coming in with communication. They can't, they can't wait any longer. Like, they're like, okay, it's, I got to go ahead and make some type of move towards cancer. Something didn't work in the past. Yeah, it was problem it was some issues the relationship needed some work some work done to it um it looks like they are feeling like a final decision needs to be made it looks like they're trying to boss up like with their work um and their finances This person could also feel like you're going to ask them for something. If you ask this person for something, they could walk away. This person may need to work on their finances. They may don't feel comfortable enough um, because they don't feel like they ha can provide you with uh, what you deserve. build their confidence up. I'm seeing Leo's energy here. But the situation is real toxic. Um, they feel like they should apologize to you, but they've been keeping it to themselves because they don't want to seem like they're forcing nothing. But I feel like I see somebody waiting to give someone something to give or some money. And I see you over here feeling like this person. Like, you know, your intuition is telling you that this person can't keep still. And that they may even have someone else on the side that they're dealing with. Like, you already have an idea of this. This situation could have been dragged out, drug out for a long period of time. Like, it's reaching a point to where it's starting to become a burden to you. Um... This person trying to give you some time to get your strength back up, to get your get get back right. So you, they just feel like you just gonna take them back. You gonna accept what they come with, and they come in. All they coming with is this: the devil and the ace of wands. They ain't doing nothing but coming with some sex. Now we got the ace of swords as the outcome. 
All right, this person is getting ready to open up. The truth is getting ready up. The truth is getting, they're getting ready to reach out to you. Knight of Cups, Page of Wands, and the Ace of Swords. Because they are trying to resolve things with you. They're starting to realize um, that the type of person that you are um, and that you don't deserve whatever it is that they tried to offer you. Um, so they're going to bow out and say that you won, you, you won this round. You won this round. When they hear what you have to say, they're going to try to make sure, like, did I hear that right? Something about the past. But they've been spying on you. They've been watching you. And they ain't been saying nothing. But they miss you. They're going to tell you that they miss you. But this person also could feel like they don't think love is for them. Maybe they should just stay single because we got the Four of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles. They're feeling like maybe I should just stay single. Um, this person could be like they think about the married life, but then they want to have options too at the same time because we got the Two of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. So this person is getting ready to open up and speak their truth to you. They is getting ready to reach out. Their intentions is to reach out. They want to open up and have an honest conversation with you. Um, whether you're going to be up to it or not. I feel like this person's uh, self-esteem is very low. I'm just going to be honest. Um, they didn't have enough confidence to be honest with you, tell you the truth, or speak how they truly feel. But I feel like after so much needed time to think and come up with how they really truly feel they're ready to talk now so be expecting communication from this person honey <sighs> it's coming all right so until next time guys ciao for now